Hi, it's Julia with ConvertKit, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a custom field, a drop down menu, or a checkbox in your forms and landing pages. This is our landing page, and as you can see here, there are already two fields the first name and the email address. Let's add a new one. So we click on this plus sign. This plus sign is in every form and every landing page, and we go to on the right, save as custom field. We select the custom field from the drop down. We can also change here the label or just leave it as it is. We can mark it as required. And there you go, your field is here. You can also drag and drop it and just change the order of the fields. One important thing here is that you should create this field before adding it to the landing page. And I will show you how. So you go to subscribers and you just pick one random subscriber. It doesn't matter the changes will apply to all of them. So this is my profile. And last name is already here because I've added it before the video. But I can add a new one. So let's click on add a new field. And let's select the address. Address, field value, here is blank, but it's okay. We don't need to fill it for now. Click on update, and there you go, your field is here. So the email address and the first name are like by default, and you can add as many custom fields as you want, but just remember that they are in alphabetical order. So you can truly really swap them, like for example, you can put the last name before the address in the just your the subscriber profile. Okay, let's go back to the landing page, and I will show you a very good thing. So let's click here. And we want to save it as tag and then checkbox. And a checkbox will appear here. We just need to add the right tag. So that's here. Let's put this ebook. These are random tags I created. You can use your tags. And here we can. Yes, I'd like to receive the guy. Okay, there you go. Here, there you go. Here we have a checkbox on your phone. And what happens if you want to add a drop down? So you go, you click on the plus sign again, then you click on tag and drop down, and then you can choose your, your tags, for example, ebook, and we can change here the label. We can put like, yes, I like to receive the guide. And then we add the other tag. Those are just random tags, so you can, you can choose your own. And then, yes. I like to see the other copy. I'm sure you can make a better copy than that. And you can also hear the label. It will show here on the, um, for the drop down. And for example, let's choose one. You can also mark it as required, so your subscribers need to choose either or. And there you go. This is how to add a custom field, a checkbox, or a drop down menu to your forms on landing pages.